Iran has inaugurated the mass production line of a new tactical unmanned aerial vehicle, which is armed with a precision-guided bomb. Iran's defense ministry on Monday unveiled Mohajer 6 drone, equipped with keen precision-guided bomb, during a ceremony attended by Defense Minister Brigadier General Amir Hatami on the occasion of the 40th anniversary of the victory of the Islamic Revolution. Speaking to reporters, Hatami said Mohajer 6 has the capability to carry out surveillance, reconnaissance and combat missions within a wide operational radius and can help the armed forces identify and destroy predetermined targets. He added that the drone could help conduct aerial surveillance for a long time and hit targets with high precision. The minister noted that the new Iranian drone was capable of sending intelligence to control and command centers during day and night and could take off from and land on short runways. During recent years, Iran has made major breakthroughs in its defense sector and attained self-sufficiency in producing important military equipment and systems. In December 2016, the Iranian army's ground forces unveiled two domestically designed and manufactured drones on the final day of major military exercises, codenamed Muhammad Rasul Allah IV, Muhammad, the Messenger of God IV, in southeastern Iran. One of the two aircraft, codenamed Akab, Eagle, is a combat drone capable of carrying air-to-surface missiles. The other, which is codenamed Shahin, Falcon, and has been developed and manufactured under a project code named Shahid Mosin Godislu, can collect information on the positions and movements of enemy forces through reconnaissance missions. It boasts a flight endurance of 24 hours. Iran's Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, IRGC, also in October 2016, unveiled the recently manufactured combat drone called Sika, Thunderbolt. The drone was put on show on Saturday at an expo showcasing the latest achievements by the IRGC's aerospace division in the UAV industry. Iran has also conducted military drills to enhance the defense capabilities of its armed forces and to test modern military tactics and state-of-the-art army equipment. The Islamic Republic maintains that its military might poses no threat to other countries, stating that its defense doctrine is merely based on deterrence. We have set up a drone center and organization, which has bases in operational areas and is currently active commander of IRGC ground forces, Brigadier General Mohammad Pakbar told Tasnim News Agency on Sunday. The IRGC ground forces possesses and has used various state-of-the-art military equipment, including combat drones, in different maneuvers showcasing the country's defense prowess. The IRGC ground forces started three-day massive military drills, codenamed Payambar Yazm 11, Great Prophet 11, on February 20 in northeastern Iran, with its motto being demonstration of power and enduring stability. The maneuvers featured the IRGC's drone, artillery, air defense, and infantry units. IRGC ground forces also practiced reconnaissance missions using the Corps' drones. In October 2016, the IRGC unveiled a combat unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, called Sika, Thunderbolt. Sika is a long-range drone capable of carrying four smart and precision-guided bombs and can strike targets with high precision. It is one of the Simurgh-class drones, which is the Iranian version of the US RQ-170 Sentinel stealth aircraft. In December 2012, the IRGC captured a U.S. Scan Eagle drone over the Persian Gulf waters upon its intrusion into the Iranian airspace. In the same month the previous year, Iran downed a U.S. RQ-170 Sentinel stealth aircraft with minimal damage. The drone was flying over the Iranian city of Kashmir, near the Afghan border, when it was brought down. Iran downed a U.S. RQ-170 Sentinel stealth aircraft with minimal damage. The drone was flying over the Iranian city of Kashmir, near the Afghan border, when it was brought down. Almost three years later, the Islamic Republic produced its version of the RQ-170 drone. Commenting on the latest achievements by the IRGC forces, commander of the IRGC's aerospace division, Brigadier General Amirali Hajizadeh, said that Iran is among the top four countries in the world in the drone industry. Hajizada further said that the U.S. is seeking to equal Iran in the production of stealth drones and bombers. 
Reflecting on Seekit, the commander said that it is the latest Iranian UAV and is capable of hitting targets and returning to base intact. He further noted that Iran will not halt its development of drones, saying, the enemy is continuing down the path of hostility and we should continue our course for reinforcing our might for defense against the enemy.